Hey everyone, before this video starts, I want to apologize for talking somewhat quietly. It's because it's laid out, I'm at a hotel room at E3, and I don't want to shout or anything like that. Not that I normally shout, but I just want to give you guys a heads up. Also, before we go any further, this video will contain some spoilers for Watch Dogs Legion. It's nothing major, but Ubisoft's press conference is tomorrow, so if you want to go in completely blind, I definitely recommend clicking on this video as this poster gives away some elements of Watch Dogs Legion. So again, click on this video if you don't want to get spoiled or anything like that. I totally understand. Alright, so a few hours ago, someone at E3 actually posted a picture of Watch Dogs Legion. Obviously, this wasn't supposed to go up. Someone leaked it, and now it's just been going all over the internet. Everyone's talking about it, and uh, this poster is it's crazy. As you can see, someone on the left is wearing a pig mask, which definitely doesn't seem Watch Dogs themed at all. Uh, on the right, there's this old grandma holding a gun, which confirms that guns will be in this game. I know some leaks actually said there wouldn't be any guns at all. That's not true. She has a gun. And right behind her, there's actually Big Ben, which confirms that this game is set in London. We already knew that, but this is more confirmation. At the bottom of the poster, there is the logo for Watch Dogs Legion, which actually looks really cool, and it's followed by some red smoke. But yeah, that's basically the poster. It's crazy and all over the place. It definitely doesn't scream Watch Dogs to me. And to be fair, it is called Watch Dogs Legion, not Watch Dogs 3. So I guess a fair comparison would be like Far Cry Primal. It has some Far Cry elements, but it's not really connected to the main series. That's the vibe I personally get from this poster. I could be completely wrong. But yeah, it just looks like it's... Saints Row 3 and 4 mixed with Watch Dogs 2. It doesn't seem like we'll be getting that serious dark story of Watch Dogs 1 back. But again, I could be completely wrong. We're going to find out tomorrow at Ubisoft's press conference, and I just had to let you all know about this poster. I don't know what to think about it. I feel like I have more questions about Watch Dogs Legion the more we find out about it. It's kind of crazy. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I'm going to eat some pizza, go to bed, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. I'll be at the Ubisoft press conference. I'm going to yell, I love you, Eve. So definitely listen for that. And yeah, I'll see you guys later.